Hi YouTube viewers, my name's TPS Tulane. I am trying to repair my check engine light. I'm getting codes 1351 and 1354, which calls for bank two sensor to re be replaced, which is this. It's a sensor. I'm gonna give it a shot here. Let's see what we can do. Okay, let's remove the cover. Put that down on the side here. Okay, first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna remove this clamp and this clamp, and then that'll free this up, and our sensor is gonna be right under here. Okay, let's give it a shot. That should be loose enough. Let's work this off. Okay, got that one. Got to give it a good tug. Here we go. Got that one. Okay. So, and also we're going to take this little clamp off and get... Just work it side to side and pull, and there you have it. Okay, let's uh, pick this up, and uh, should be able to just raise it up enough to see the, the next part, which is this, the OVC. It's pretty accessible. Anyway, uh, I'm going to hold this up out the way, so we'll have a little working room here. That should do it. Should have enough room to get to the uh, the valve control sensor right here. So there you go. Okay, it's coming pretty easy. Grab it by hand so we don't drop it. that let's put it down here and now we got to work it loose ah, came out easy that's good let's see what we got I'm pretty dirty should get a rag let me put it back wait a second here while I go get a rag okay we're gonna clean this up right here Try to clean the hole a little bit. Uh, get anything that's close out of there dirty. I'm not sure if you can see this, but anyway, we're doing the best we can with this video here. Okay. Now the tricky part is to remove the clip which I've break, broken them in the past so let's see what we got hmm okay let's look at this the new one here's the new part just like the old one okay we got to watch that clip, so let's see if we can get that clip off without breaking it. We should be good to go. Oh, yeah. Maybe I ought to disconnect the battery. Just a second. I'm going to disconnect the battery just to be safe here. I 
anytime you're fooling with electrical parts, it's always a good idea to disconnect the battery, prevent a short. Anyway, that's my philosophy. Okay, let's go ahead and try to remove the clip. Get this bad boy off. But once again, I've broken the clip, so this is not good. But we'll manage somehow. Just kind of work it down. And there you have it. Okay, got the old one off. Pretty dirty. I'm getting ready to put the new one on. Hopefully, that solves the problem. Okay, let's go ahead and reconnect. And push it good and hard. Way we don't have any problem but it coming loose down the road. Put it back in the in the cylinder. Good fit. Okay. Hope you're able to see all of this. I know I'm not an expert at shooting video, but just to give you an idea of what you're dealing with. Okay, looks like we've gotten it. Let's get the 10 millimeter and put it back. Tighten that bad boy up. Let's see what we got. Put everything back the way it was. Sorry, I hope this video comes out. I'm just it's a hit or miss. I'm trying to do it by myself, so bear with me. Okay, got it tight. And uh, we're going to put the hoses back on and, and give it a shot. Okay, let's see. Let's get the rag out. I'll put this little bad boy back in. Just worried about this clamp slipping out one day, but I think we'll be okay. And unhook the, the contraption here. Put the hat back on with the phone, with the uh, camera. And let's work this back into position. Which, let's see what we got here. Let's put, let's get the, uh, reverse order okay we'll put this one back since we know this one's fairly easy to get on there just work it back and forth left to right with a little pressure piece slipped on itself pretty well oops one problem forgot to put the old the old gasket on so that bad boy's got to come off there we go line it up with with the arrow set it right where it belongs now we're going to work on this this seems to be the tough part, getting this seated. I'm gonna try from a different angle here. Super. Just work this piece back, left to right. Everything looks lined up. There we go, okay. Now, Let's just tighten up what we have. All right. 
one more here. Okay, that's it. Put the top back on, the cover. We should be good to go. Thanks for watching. TPS on and I hope this fixes your check engine light. Take care, that's the old part. Pretty dirty, hopefully that, that does the trick. Thank you, have a great day.